we are at St. Anthony. We're gonna need to seal the cracks in the driveway. <laughs> need to seal this crack between the house and the porch. I wanna paint these uh, posts. Probably this woodwork here. All this other stuff can really just be cleaned up. You might wanna paint this front door since it's the front door and want everything to look good. Probably need to extend these gutters a little bit. Usually the county requires us to do that. We're gonna have to trim these bushes or rather weeds down. Uh, I have to trim back these bushes too. Uh, fix this gate so it'll close. Yeah, the county requires us to trim all these bushes. This all seems fine. More weeds to kill. What do you want us to do with this? You want us to paint this, power wash it? I'd at least power wash it. You probably would power wash it and then stain it again. Stain the gutter. Yeah, I would want to make this look nicer. some kind of bumper on here which I guess is what that little piece of wood is this thing needs to be replaced it might be better to just replace the whole door we're gonna get new exterior locks get new nickel hardware for the interior doors so I'm not sure what to do with the floor the hardwood looks fine but then you've got this laminate in the hallway and underneath it it might not be fine uh, I don't know, we can just put laminate on top of everything or take up this floor and see what it looks like and then sand and refinish the hardwood. And I'm not real sure what to do with the floors. I would definitely want to put tile in here and not do laminate into the kitchen on this house and then do new tile in the bathrooms uh, in here we're going to demo all this take down the wall tile uh, i would personally like to put a tile in the shower wall but we don't have to I mean, I would normally do that on like a rental property, but if you guys don't want to spend the money on it, that's fine. Get new medicine cabinets, new lights, new towel racks, new everything in here. Kitchen layout, I'm not really sure what else to do here. I don't really want to open that up. You can maybe go down one more stud if you want. then that's going to cause an issue with the floor. And if we're putting a new floor in, then it you know, should be fine. These are some cheap kitchen cabinets. These are just stock kitchen cabinets. They're in good shape. 
Uh, if it was a rental, I would keep it, but for sale, I'd probably want to upgrade on the cabinets. And then of course, get a countertop. We can keep that light. Yeah, no, these aren't kind of, they're just cheap looking lights. They're good shape, but they're cheap looking. Probably have somebody replace all the lighting. We can get rid of this little sliding door. We don't need that. So in here, I keep the floor in here. This is fine since it's like separate from the other rooms. Uh, and keep the ceiling. In the garage, the light bulbs burn out. I think all I gotta do is fix that. The, the wheel came off the track. Uh, and get a garage remote. So we're going to do a backsplash in here also. You see they had carpet in here. So we can keep these baseboards and put laminate down and then put some quarter round down. Change out all the outlets and switches. Same thing in this bathroom. We'll take all this stuff out. Again, if it was me, I would keep the shower base, but then put tiles around. Uh, but if you don't want to spend money on tile, I mean, that, that pretty much everybody's putting tile in. Take that mirror out, get a medicine cabinet. Take down the blinds. Get that closet door back on the track. Get that burnt piece of stuff out of there. What is this wood? Yeah, you gotta clean this and kill it. It's gonna be a little bit of wall repairs whenever you paint. Get new heat and air vents, new thresholds, new smoke detectors, a little bit of a repair there. That light needs to be changed. We're going to paint these basement steps. Take out that piece of paneling, put a new piece of paneling. Looks like they had carpet down here too. Clean and kills that. Repair that door and put it back. Got a little bit of a leak there. I need to replace that ceiling tile. See what's causing that leak. There's a couple missing tiles and down here we can replace. Uh, yeah, this has been leaking here. Take that down and replace the paneling on it. There's a plumbing right there. That's going into the, uh, looks like the tub. I mean, down here on the floor, I might just want to paint this floor also. Looks like it was already painted. Just paint it again. We can leave that if you want to save some money or we can soften around it.
interwebs. Somebody was a drummer. Find out where that leak's coming from outside there and clean that up. Uh, do something outside to keep the water from coming in. I probably want to kill these basement walls here. Nineteen ninety one, we'll go ahead and replace that. Uh you probably keep this really. The furnace. Panel looks newer. You know, once we get here, we'll see if anything's leaking. But all this kind of stuff looks fine. Check out the tub. See what's going on with it. There was an old leak here. You can see. Okay, that's it.